Hey guys, Tony Mowing Grass. Um, got my phone out here um, after a long, long day of uh, lawn practice. Um, I did maybe like 12 yards a day or something. Me and me and my brother, so we were kicking some butt. Um, but anyway, I said I was going to do a review of my Xmark 21 inch, and so I'm going to do that. Um, and here we go. Let me show you. Alright, this is a mower that I bought used on Craigslist. I have the bagger for it too, it's not right here. But I was just going to do a, uh, a review of what of my thoughts of it. Um, I bought this used and um, it was a little rough. It still is a little rough, but it was... Uh, I had uh, my mechanic man was fixing a few things on it and um, was heating up the engine to change the oil and the... Um, the motor locked up so um you know it is what it is um it was a real bummer so now i have i have a brand new kawasaki engine on there um and now i have pretty much the amount of money that i would have if i bought one brand new but you know now the mower is almost like new it, it you know it doesn't look as good as new but it you know with a new motor it's pretty good other than the transmission and a lot of this other stuff is new um so, but anyway, I absolutely love this mower. Um, one of the things that I wasn't sure, you know, if it made a difference of before I had one, um, I didn't know if it was really faster than, um, you know, let's say, because I have probably five different, um, you know, your normal um, box store, Home Depot, whatever, mowers. Um, and this thing is way faster. I mean, it is way faster. Um, you know, I'm not, I know some people say it's not but the one I have is very fast and it is um it's only a one speed um this is kind of like your lower end one I think it's the dealer said around a thousand new you could get one um anyway but I really love it it they're kind of like the tires are kind of like rubber almost or and they almost feel a little hollow on the back nah they might not be but they they do really good at holding the ground, and part of that's because the machine's real heavy, but the rubber tires with bearings um, makes a big difference. Um, another thing I love is when you're mowing and you want to turn around, like when you let go of the self-propel, it like free rolls. Like it does this even when it's running. Whereas, you know, like your normal, um, your normal self-propel mower, like, when you let go of the self propeller, turn around if you want to roll or something, it's like really hard, like it doesn't want you to do that. Um, so that's one thing I really love about it. I love that it's fast. Um, it doesn't it doesn't bog or slow down going up hills. I mean, it'll pull you right up. I got, there's a yard that's actually in one of my other videos where it's um, got a pretty steep hill. There's multiple, like terrace, multiple levels or whatever. And it's got that very thick grass on it and this thing kicks butt. I'm not saying that it's easy. You know, it's still work, but this thing, it does awesome. Um, so I would, I would highly recommend these. Maybe not if you're, you know, if you're just cutting your own yard at your house. But if you're doing this seriously, professionally, and you plan on doing it for years to come, you know, I'd say this is absolutely a good investment. I really, I really want one of the wide ones too. That'll come in time. But, um, I really love it. Um, it's really great. Let me see if we can... This doesn't have a choke on it. I'm gonna do this three times and we'll see if we can get it fire up and I'll see if I can show you. Y'all might want to turn down the volume. It might get a little loud. I do all this on my phone so it's not... I can't really like edit the sound or anything or I don't really know how to. And it's, you know, not... Computers aren't really part of my job so I don't really mess with them that much. So I don't know... I don't know very much. Anyway, see if it'll run. As you guys could probably see, it was very quick. Um, you know, I'm on, on a pretty big span of grass here. Sorry, the grass isn't that pretty. It's kind of going out of season. 
But um, anyway, I'm, I'm on a pretty big span of front yard, and um, it goes really quick. Um, and that smoke, it always does that because I, I guess because when I push the gas in there, but if you don't do that, it takes a while to start it. Um, and that was a cold start. Um, so anyway, overall, I would say yes, I love it. There's really no, um, see this metal plate, the bag's great, the suction is amazing, it throws in the bag really hard, half a gallon of gas it holds, there's many good things. The only, the only one thing that I don't like about it is maybe that it's really heavy, so it's one person you're trying to put in pickup truck, it's pretty hard. Um, but other than that, and that's not really a big deal because I pretty much roll mine, you know, it goes up on inside trailer and stuff anyway but other than that um i say it's awesome let's see if we can see way down there i'm probably this is at my dad's farm in one of his fields but i'm probably um i'd say probably between 60 and 100 feet down there so pretty good ways let's see how long it takes us to get there Tony Mowing Grass, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to email me, tonymowinggrass at gmail.com with one G, and thank you for watching.